Here in Leicestershire Partnership Trust we have a very, very comprehensive uh, package that support all our uh, new starters to the organisation. I think the role is really important and one that's overlooked vastly by the population. And I'm actually quite surprised at how many people think you don't have to be a nurse to be one. But I think it's a really important role for supporting families as the under five group is quite a, a huge one and they have really high needs. Um, and I want to be a part of that and make a change to them. Um, well, all of the health assistants that have uh, sort of been spent time with me, they've really enjoyed the, the mix of theory and practice. So there's two days a week are clinical and two days a week theory at the, at, uh, the, at the university. Um, and they found that actually that mix means that there's a good, a good balance um, there. They're able to apply the theory that they're learning to actual practical situations. I'm looking forward to actually getting within a team and being settled and established so that I can have a look a little bit more about the needs of my area. It's something that we talk quite heavily at university about meeting the needs of our clients. And as a student, you kind of see that on the periphery, but I really want to be a part of that and start to change things and improve outcomes for my families. I, uh, while I was nursing, I really enjoyed teaching and enjoyed counselling and supporting patients. And I felt that uh, working in that capacity, I would gain that through health visiting. It's a really heavy course, to be fair. Um, one that I knew was going to be heavy and hard work, but didn't quite appreciate it until I got out here. But it's a good balance between being in the university setting and learning all the academic stuff, and balancing that out with actually being with your health visitor, being within your teams and embedded in their practice. So it's hard, but fun. Well, when the students come out to us in practice, they're either assigned to a, a practice teacher or a mentor. But because of my other role as a clinical lead, um, the students that, that I oversee are assigned to, to mentors. And my role then is to ensure that the work that they come out with, they have to do a portfolio of evidence to make sure that they've actually met their learning outcomes. And that's the evidence to show that they've actually reached those competencies um, through their practice. They're also allocated a preceptor and they follow a preceptorship pack which includes um, regular support with a, a preceptor, um, clinical supervision. We also now, um, in, as we've been an early implementation site, we also offer um, restorative supervision as well as clinical supervision um, and a very comprehensive training pack. For me it's the challenge. Um, I have been a health visitor now for 20 years and I would sum it up by saying it's a, a job or a role that you never really master. Um, going into uh, patients' families' homes uh, to make that initial assessment is never predictable. I get a practice teacher within my placement who's really good and I shadow her regularly. And also I have the mix of the, of the teams of nurse nurses and experienced health visitors. And also I'm lucky in the fact that we've got newly qualified health visitors within my team. So I get a lot of support and a lot of understanding because people have been there quite recently so they know how it feels. Well, Leicester is a very, very diverse community. Um, you know, we have quite a, a mixed population. There's a lot of health needs and varying health needs, both within the city limits but also within Leicestershire itself, within those county boundaries. So there's lots of opportunity for, for getting a really wide range of experience um, wherever you're placed within your training. In uh, Leicestershire, we are currently um, offering lots of training places for student health visitors. Uh, we're working with De Montford University. Um, we think we offer a very, very exciting and comprehensive training programme for our student health visitors and are quite unique in the fact that our students gain experience in both um, county uh, localities for maybe semester one and two and then go into city localities for final practice or vice versa. And I think you know, no two areas the same because most areas work in neighbourhood working so there's a team of you so you're never sort of working on your own um, and so the level of support on a day-to-day -day basis is really good. We've also got you know, very good robust um, support networks, we've got a good team of practice teachers, we've got some really enthusiastic um, and capable mentors that are out there to, to support students. When we're looking at health visitors who, who are coming to work with us in Leicestershire Partners Trust or students, obviously the quality we're looking for are uh, they need to be professional, they're nurses or midwives uh, foremost, so obviously as well as health visitors they need to be professional following their code of conduct. They need to be able to communicate, 
they need to be able to work independently but equally as part of a team. And would you recommend it? I certainly would. It's been a really good and valuable experience so far. The trust are really supportive both on a managerial level but also down on the ground so you're getting good support all the time. So I think it's really worthwhile and something that we should strive to do.